I might remember these ladies on the show a few months back, uh, just before our uh, big bust to move event. Boy, we had a good time there, eh? It was really it good. It was time. fun, yeah. <laughs> Samantha Banks and Lauren Seller are here. Uh, you were uh, you had a, a cancer event going on. A word which I cannot say on television goes with it. Mm-hmm. Now, you're back, and you've got the Night of Courage thing happening for the second year, right? Yes. All right. What's going on? First of all, what's going on with Night of Courage? What happens? A Night of Courage is a night where the M Entertainment Group bars, which there are five of them, will... Urban Mail Magazine, right? Yes, Urban yeah. Mail Magazine, sorry. Right. Will host parties at each one of their bars, and all, do, all cover charges, proceeds, uh, anything that happens at the bars, will go towards the cancer... Auto one night. Regional cancer one night. What night is it? Friday. July, this Friday? July 27th. This Friday. This Friday, you must go out to one of these uh, establishments. And there are five of them, you say? There are five. Okay, can you name them off? Lobby. Yeah. Mansion. Right. Tequila Jack. Yes. The Buddha Bar. Uh huh. And Union Station. Union Station. Excellent. Five clubs <laughs> that I've been barred from. But anyway, <laughs> uh, no, it's actually such a great time, and uh, it really works. Out. Last year, I heard, was fantastic for the first year. They yes. raised over seventeen thousand dollars. So we want to make it all happen again. Mm -hmm. right? Yes. So it's this Friday night. This Friday. Now, you ladies. I tell you what, um, you guys have been working hard uh, to try and beat cancer. I mean, you had a, a couple of events already. You're always doing this. What, what inspires you to get involved in this sort of thing? I think it comes down to supporting a good cause, yeah. raising awareness, advocating on behalf of our generation because we're young, we're young adults and yeah. we, we want to spread the word and do innovative events that get people out yeah. and raise money. Yeah because some of the things you've come up with are different than anything else, and that's a good thing. Yeah. Because sometimes it's hard to find different avenues, different methods of raising money and awareness, don't you think? Definitely. Yeah, so you've come up with uh, a couple of interesting ways to go about it, which is fun. What, why, why do it? What, what's in it for you? What do you like about it? Well, for me personally, my mother was diagnosed with cancer a couple years back, mm -hmm. so to fight for something or to support something that I know I've been touched by, and I know other people have been touched by, is, I find it, as to no pun intended, courageous, because yeah, yeah. so many people don't know what to do about it, or don't yeah. know how to, don't know, don't know how to release yeah. their feelings. And, and so you, here yeah, you could come together with other people that are maybe feeling the same way. Yeah, and I think you make an impact with others of your age group, or your friends, or your friends' friends, and so on, and that word spreads. Exactly. Right? And I noticed something interesting when I was reading about your fundraiser and what you guys are up to and why you do it. It's one thing to write a check or, or donate through your credit card for various events, a couple hundred bucks here and there. It's a completely different thing to give of your time and energy, don't you think? Definitely. And, I mean, a lot of people do both, don't get me wrong, but if you get your hands into it, right, it really helps out in a different way, not just monetarily, but... In a, in a bigger way, I think, and that's that's pretty important. Like and me and Lauren, we're, we're just graduating and going back to school, but we want to make a difference. Yeah. And my mom also has cancer, yeah. and we're not. I think in the back of our head, we do it for our parents, but we're here to spread the word, yeah. and, we, yeah. and we really want well, people to understand that. It's easy to tell that it's important to you guys as individuals and as a group to to try and make that difference, to try and and do something that maybe other people your age wouldn't do. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And I think that rubs off on a lot of people, and I think that's important. How do people find out more about uh, Night of Courage? Uh, there's two different ways. You can go to the Ottawa Regional Cancer Foundation website, uh -huh. which I think is ottawacancer.ca, yes. or the um, Entertainment Group website, yeah. um, .ca, yeah, or yeah. our Facebook group. Yeah, they're on our, uh, our screen right now. So uh, it's this Friday night. I hope you have a great time. Thank you. It's hugely successful. And uh, I'm sure I'll see you back here uh, probably in six months with another, <laughs> we another have, something going we on. We hope so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, ladies. Thank Good you. Good to have you here.